What is up guys? This is Billy and it's been a while since I've made an update video. Last update video was it was in the summer so probably around June or July I think so. Yeah and I've gotten a few new uh, add-ons to my setup, my area, my workstation, gaming station, battle station, whatever you want to call it. I've added a couple of new things that I would like to show you guys. So yeah, um, I'm going to give you a little room tour, you know, and you're actually going to be able to see inside my closet now. Um, so yeah, I uh, can't wait to show you guys. So let's get on with this shit, because I've talked too much already. Let's do this. Okay, so first off, there is my bed, which broke down not too long ago, and my lovely mother actually um, found out how to fix it. So sweet, my bed, my bed's right there. Uh, there's the mirror, and we are going to go into this little crevice here, which is my closet. Open up both of these doors. Okay, so up, all up there are, uh, are all the boxes that I have, um, you know, gotten in the mail from all of my products. I have my Razer Naga um, Molten Edition right there. I have my Halo 4 Xbox 360 Limited Edition box. I have my Astros up here. I have the mouse mat that uh, my buddy Matt actually uh, get, uh, gave me for my birthday a couple of years ago. Uh, geez, I don't know. My Western Digital 3 terabyte hard drive. Dude, I, I have basically every box that I've ever ordered. It's mostly Razer products. Um, but yeah, they're all up there. And, uh, you know, I just got like laptop cases and an alarm clock that I don't use. Uh, some games... Uh, don't really keep all my games here. Uh, some drawers where I keep my underwear and bullshit. Uh, my shirts. Let's see what we have in here. More shirts. It's a little dark. And more shirts. Yeah, I got my shirts and pants everywhere. So, yeah, that's enough of my closet. Now, a little, little area over here. You will see that. Where the fuck did my TV stand go? Billy, where the fuck did you do it? What did you do with it? Where is it? Where is it? My cable box is on the floor as of right now, sitting on top of my GeForce GTX 780 Superclocked box. Um, I'm going to be getting a TV stand soon enough. I just got to figure out what I'm going to do with it. kind of have like cables running, and uh, I'm going to fix that. There's a huge fucking Slipknot poster. It's almost as tall as I am. Uh, I got these posters, same posters that I've had in my other video, basically. Um... Call of Duty. Oh, I can't. I can't show you that area yet. Not yet. It's not ready. Um, there's Halo. All that bullshit. And I got another Slipknot poster over there. As um, when I was younger, I used to be obsessed with Slipknot, so that's why I have so many of them. Uh, they were my number one go-to band for the longest time. All right. So <laughs> you're probably asking, Billy, why do you have this huge piece of fabric? going across your room like this. Uh, well, funny you should ask. I actually have uh, these hangers uh, clinched to the ceiling. I could easily just take them off and then like hang them up here when I'm not using it. Um, but yeah, I'll show you that right now. This, my good sirs, is a green screen. Uh, this is what I use for my live streams. So if I go to this monitor right here, you can see that I am chroma keyed What's up, guys? Welcome to the live stream. Uh, but yeah, I'm Chroma Kid. Here's uh, my other monitor, which is now displaying my World of Warcraft character. Pretty sweet. Yeah, look at that. That's sexy as balls. So nice. I love those shoulders. I'm actually going to enter the world right now because I was in queue. All right, but yeah, um, on to the setup. Whoa, what is that? My TV. My TV is now on my desk, along with my three monitor displays. My TV is on my desk, displaying, what is that? Call of Duty Ghosts? You damn straight it is. I have Call of Duty Ghosts, and I've been playing it quite a bit. Um, I've been going back and forth between World of Warcraft and uh, Call of Duty Ghosts recently. I'm uh, kind of overwhelmed with video games. But yeah, down here I just have, you know, my deodorant. Uh, shaker cup for my Gamma Labs G Fuel. There's a sticker that Gamma Labs gave me. I haven't even done anything with it yet because I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, 3D glasses that I've gotten 
couple of years ago when I went to the movies. Remote control, bottle of water. Okay, sorry about that. I accidentally ended the video. Guys, this stuff is my new obsession. This is Gamma Labs G Fuel. It's more of a nutritional formula than it is an energy drink. It's not your average energy drink. This stuff, you might have seen it in my um, my review for this stuff. Uh, this stuff gets you going. You wake up, you have uh, like 16 ounces of this. This stuff will wake you up. You're ready. You like wake up. You, you're ready to stream. You're ready to game. You're ready to do whatever you do. You're, it, it really just like gets you going and uh, keeps you focused without the crash or jitters afterwards. Um, so yeah, look into this stuff. Gamma Labs G Fuel. I think you guys would really enjoy it. Um, I have the watermelon and blue ice here right now. I, uh, they just came out with a new flavor actually called mango peach, which I am dying to try. I'm probably going to order some of that really, very, 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 very soon. All right. So on here is my Xbox 360, uh, Halo 4 limited edition console. This is probably the most sexiest thing or it's the most sexiest Xbox I have ever seen in my life because it's translucent. Can't see it much on my iPhone 5S's camera though. Uh, there is my wired, or wireless I should say, Halo uh, Breach mic that I still use till this day. It's working perfectly. Um, but yeah, my TV is a 42 inch Vizio. I have had it for years and it is still working perfectly for me. And uh, yeah, I love this damn thing. Uh, actually, let me show you guys something. <coughs> I recently got my concealed Cobra ghillie suit in um, Call of Duty Ghosts. I am super proud of it. I, uh, you know, it took me a while of raping my kill death ratio, as you can see, of getting this thing. So thank God I got it. Here's my profile. Yeah, you can see that. All right, so um, I still have the color changing LEDs on the back, the IKEA dioders, which is all controlled from this little panel right here. Uh, you can change the color any way you want. You can have it blinking. You can basically have this thing uh, customized to your uh, personal personal wants. Just walking around and wow for a little bit. Oh yeah, sweet. Dude, I love this uh, transmog, looks sexy. All right, so um, yeah, here is uh, the TeamSpeak server. But here is uh, my little uh, like normal streaming monitor where I keep my stream up and uh, have me in that little corner right there, as you can see. What up? Uh, here is my PC. This is my PC tower, which if anything happened to this poor baby, I would be so upset. Uh, the specs, I have a GTX 780 super clocked with ACX cooling graphics card. I also have an FX 8120 AMD 8 core processor. I have an 800 watt power supply, 8 uh, gigabytes of DDR3 uh, mem memory. Ah, uh, shit, what else is in there? I have liquid cooling for my CPU. I don't know if you can see that little light right there. It's liquid cooling in there. I have these, uh, I have two of these uh, crystal blue um, LED fans, and they really keep my tower extremely cool. Uh, as you can see right there in the temps, 27 degrees Celsius. Um, I love this case. This case, you know, I'm extremely happy I went with it. Uh, this opens just like that. And you can see my NZXT Hue lighting controller in there. I can basically like do anything I want off from this panel. Make my computer light up any way I want it to. It's pretty sweet. All right. Well, uh, back here I just have a few boxes. Um... My headset that I use has changed. There's been a big change. Let me show you guys what rotten is out. These are the Astro A40s, uh, with along with the Mixamp Pro. Uh, yeah, I can't go to any other headset after I've had Astros. These things are my number one go-to headset now. I will never go to another headset company. Uh, there is my <clears throat> my webcam, my Logitech C920. This thing uh, goes up to 1080p quality. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys about this. This, my good people, is the Avermedia Live Gamer Portable capturing device. You know, the cool thing about this, you can capture it from any console, even the new generation consoles coming out. So let's say um, <clears throat> when I capture my uh, gameplay, Call of Duty, 
Because right now I have it hooked up to my Xbox. All you gotta do is press that button and watch. Just watch. Boom. Software opens up automatically with a little intro. And all I gotta do is go to Pro and uh, I just press it again and it records. Straight, just like that. Instant recording. Um, I would show you more, but right now I have my live stream open. So, uh, yeah. I'm not going to open it up. <clears throat> Alright, so, um, yeah, guys, I'm super excited to, uh, for the Xbox One coming out. Uh, you know, it's going to be so sweet. I just really can't wait. Um, hopefully there's no console war comments. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm just so done with the console war. Here's my Razer Lycosa uh, uh, gaming keyboard. It's the Mirror Edition. And this right here, as I as you saw the box in my closet, this is the Razer Naga Molten Edition. But as you can see, it is very different from the original Razer Naga. This right here has modded LEDs. I bought it on eBay. Some guy was selling them for like $30 more than the original because he customized the LEDs. It's one of a kind. Like, why wouldn't I get it, you know? <laughs> like, for 30 extra dollars, if I can be, you know, uh, different than, you know, I'm, like, very, very into having uh, different technology from everyone else. Uh, so, yeah, I try to make it stand out. Here's my 3 terabyte uh, Western Digital external hard drive, uh, which I keep, like, most of my videos on. Uh, is there anything else I could show you guys? Still looking. Still looking around my room. Do a little spin. Ah, here's my lamp, which gives like such a nice lighting effect. Uh, yeah, it's really nice. Someone was just throwing it away one day and decided to pick it up and bring it in here. And yeah, I love it. Love it so much. Such nice lighting in my room. All right, guys. Well, that should do it. That should do it about the little updates. Little update on uh, my setup, my area, my station, whatever you want to call it. I will see you dudes later, and hopefully there uh, you guys enjoyed my uh, setup area update video. So, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Adios, amigos.